Hi, I'm Yoris Kazin, and I'm gonna take you for a Gates Plus tutorial. So let's start. So I have already built my frame for my gates, so I'm just gonna place my blocks to get my coordinates of the gate. Then I type GP test. Oh, damn it, not create. Test, yeah, like this. So now I click my first location and my second. Then I'm gonna show an example of the gate. That's how big it is. And then I'm gonna confirm it by typing GP create. So that's it, my gate has been saved. If you power the gate, it's gonna go up. If it's not powered, it's gonna go come down. It's that easy. It's protected against griefing, like try to break it or setting on fire. You can also set the material of the gate. Doing that by typing uh, GPZM your gate name and the material ID number. It still works like it normally does, but with another material. Now I'm gonna go list my gates. You see I have one out of five and my gates are test. That's the only one I got. And now I'm gonna delete it because I can. That's why. So let's delete it. We don't need that anymore, it's not doing anything at all. Okay, if I do GP um, list gates, ah, oh, damn it, typed it wrong again. List gates and a player name, like say my brother Tom Class 3, it's gonna list the gates of that player you type, but he doesn't have any, just I'm not going to do that. GP, uh, GP delete gates with the player name and the gate name, like test. It's gonna delete the gate of the player, and the gate is gonna delete his test, but he doesn't have a gate, so I won't do that. Now I'm gonna talk about the config file. So go to your server. Go to plugin files and you're gonna find gate plus and the config. Open the config. I prefer Notepad C. Okay, so time example visible 5. What that's gonna do is the amount of time the example of the gate is gonna be visible. Max and gates 5. That's the max amount of gates one player can have. Material ID is the are the materials that are available in the server. Default mat ID are the default blocks that anyone can use, like regular players that have the right to create a gate. They can use these blocks. If you have the permission donator. You can use the donator mat ID blocks like one of four, that's like stone and cobblestone. The remaining block, 18, is only gonna be used by admins or ops of the server. So, you have um, gate owners, it's gonna be said my name because I have created a gate. Under my name, you're gonna see and gates at zero because I don't have one. You're gonna see test bestaat zero. It's like it doesn't exist. So you can just delete that, it's not a problem. Because it doesn't exist. It's still in the file, but the gate doesn't exist. You can also delete my name, it's not a problem at all. It's gonna be there again when I create it all over again. Quick re reload. Oh, it deletes the variable as well. Ah, it doesn't matter. Comes back when you create a gate. So that was it. If you have any questions, please ask me. And have fun.
Bye.